Hey guys, what's up? It's Hannah Gilmore with Nashline Country, and on this episode of our quarantine series, we are talking to Ty Herndon. Let's check it out. The 2020 Love and Acceptance event will be joined by a wide variety of country music artists. Tell us about this event and what it means to you. I started this concert for all of my LGBTQ youth out there and our country music youth, and it basically is this. If there's a kid in need, we want to help them. If there's a person in need, we want to help them. And the Concert for Love and Acceptance says exactly that. So we partnered with the Academy of Country Music Lifting Lives this year. And Glad, of course, been my partner for the last five years. And of course, our amazing team of people at CMT. So um, our goal is just to make sure that people in need have what they need. We love you guys and you matter. And uh, that's the foundation for love and acceptance. You will also be alongside CMT host Cody Allen. You've both been hosting this event since 2017. Tell us about Cody and what's it like having his support. I've had the honor of working with Cody Allen for the last uh, four years, and maybe more than that. I'm so bad with, uh, with, with, with time and dates, but Cody's always kind of been in my life. Uh, it feels that way anyway. You know how you guys meet those people and they, just, they feel like they've always been there? Cody is tremendously brave he is fearless when it comes to supporting um, people's lives, LGBTQ, uh, youth. The fact that he is so wide open with his heart makes me proud to work with him. I know this event means so much to you and so many others joining. What are you hoping that people take away from an event like this? Have you guys seen the lineup for this year? I mean, my goodness. Uh, holy cow. From Terry Clark, oh my gosh, to Brett Young, to Michael Ray. Uh, to Rita Wilson, to Kristen Chenoweth, to Matt Bomer, uh, Lauren Elena. I mean, the list continues. So we're hoping that people walk away from this knowing that, that they matter. That uh, my grandmother always just say, used to say, put a thousand hearts on the table and you can't tell a difference with anyone. It's just a thousand hearts on the table. So um, I hope that people walk away knowing that, that they matter and that if there's a need, we fill it. We're certainly gonna try to. And all these people are speaking about love. They're speaking about big love. And so if you can walk away from that feeling changed in some small way that you love bigger, then, um, then I feel like we've done our job just a little bit. Do you have anything coming up music-wise that you can share with us for the remainder of 2020? So we got a lot of music coming towards you. I'm doing two new albums this year. I had a moment when the second day the world stopped turning, it's that COVID day. It sucked. Uh, I know we all felt it. You know, we lost our jobs. We lost our ability to even fill our dreams. I was one of those people and I kind of ended up in the corner for a minute, um, just wondering what's next. Eventually it was not about, you know, what I lost, but it became more about what can I do? What can I do to help? And, you know, serving a higher power and knowing that, that things would get better. And I believe that, and they are getting better. And we just have to all continue our journey of taking care of each other, wearing our mask, washing our hands, and we're out and about. Please social distance. Our Patreon page, it was just kind of an exclusive behind the scenes look. Uh, check our Patreon page out. You know, it's like the old fashioned fan club. You know, it's $5 a month, you know, and you get a lot of exclusive content. But we're using that to kind of uh, uh, move forward and uh, being able to make music. We're making two new records, a documentary and the book. It will be coming um, this year or early next year. And we launched the Foundation for Love and Acceptance. And I'll be working full time with that with a bunch of a great team of people uh, to make a difference in the world. So that's what's, uh, that's what's ahead for me. Thanks for watching another episode of Nashline Country's Quarantine Series. I'll see you next time. You will also be alongside I'm ready. You will also be alongside CMT host Cody Allen. You've been. Hang on. Oh, so Keep going. Okay. <laughs> you will also be alongside CMT co-host Co. Stop it.